the Tonkinese. Love the look of plush fur? Get a Tonkinese cat. They look very elegant. The Tonkinese, or as I like to call it, the Tonks, is a Siamese Bernese mix. From the Siamese side, they get curiosity and intelligence. And you really see the Siamese on the face. And from the Burmese side, they get their personality. They actually have very outgoing vocal personalities. They're very mischievous little creatures. They're always looking to investigate. And everything is really a game. Having two tonks instead of just one allows them to keep each other entertained. And guess what? The largest cat litter ever born was to this breed, 19 little Tonkinese. The average cat has only five kittens in a litter. Historians say this cat was first found in the Tonkin region of Indochina during the 1800s and made it to our country in 1930, arriving in San Francisco. And that cat, Wang Mao, became the originator of not only the Tonkinese breed, but the Burmese as well. The Tonk is a slim, muscular-bodied, medium-sized cat that is heavier than it appears, weighing between 6 and 20 pounds. Their coat is short and silky soft. The fur is so soft and the color is really splendid. The colors are platinum, champagne, blue, and natural, which is basically a seal-type color. And the coat patterns are pointed, solid, or mink. And where a tonk lives will determine how light or dark the coat will be. Cooler temperatures control an enzyme that brings out darker colors in the fur. If you're in a colder climate, you get a darker color. And their eyes complement their coat. The most impressive are the aqua-colored version found on the mink. Most Tonkinese should live indoors. Cats that are indoors need a lot of stimulation. We're taking them out of their natural habitat, so we want to create a lot of interest in staying indoors. These cats can live long lives, but watch out for gingivitis. So good dental care is really important. As for grooming, it's pretty easy. They don't shed too much and probably only need to brush them once a week. Would they make a good family pet? They would for a family that wants a playful cat. So in general, the Tonkinese is a great cat to keep indoors. They tend to have long, healthy lives, but watch out for gingivitis. When it comes to grooming, a weekly brushing will do the trick. As for being a good pet, they are for a family looking for playful companionship.